Now, if you're doing 10 exams, you're going to have some fluctuations. Fluctu fluctuations are totally normal and to be expected because no one else at test form is identical to another. One might have a harder game section. One might have an easier reading count section. And one might play to your strengths. One doesn't. So you want to know that no one particular practice test represents your true ability. Instead, you want to apply what I call the law of averages. The law of averages is you take the most recent five exams you've done and you average them. And you take that as the best indication of where you stand. But no one single exam alone is perfectly representative. It's not a large enough sample because you might've been sick. You might've been tired. You might've been hungover. Again, it might not have played to your strengths. So if you take five of them that you've done relatively recently, those will be the best indication of where you stand and they will help you predict how you will do on test day itself. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.